There's all kinds of things that are going on. We kicked off International Education Week today with the Charles Gildersleeve Know Your World uh, lecture, which was about uh, a, a famous UNO project, the uh, uh, Biblical Archaeology Digs in, in Bethsaida in, uh, in the Holy Land. That's not the only thing going on this week. Dean Thomas Gutierrez explains more. International students doing representations concerning their culture, they're writing out people's names in Japanese or Chinese or Arabic script. This is something that we've always conducted, but we do our own activities with the resources we have on campus. And the biggest resource we have on campus, of course, are all of the international participants. With all the international students on campus, they were able to put on a photo contest as well. It's important to know that when you have as many as nearly 1,700 participants from abroad, that, uh, that they are contributing as well to the economy. So it's important for citizens from Nebraska to understand that this is a give and take thing that's very much yeah. to our advantage. We learn from it, e economics, our commerce is <laughs> stimulated by it, and uh, we are enriched both in terms of entertainment as well as knowledge uh, that comes from these exchanges. International Education Week here at UNO provides global awareness and a chance to expand international connections between students, faculty members of UNO, and even the citizens of the state of Nebraska. For more information on what's going on this week, visit the Arts and Science Hall right behind me on the second floor in the International Studies Office. For the Omaha News, I'm Megan Lackman.